it's Tybug and Happy New Year! I'm so happy to see you guys again. So let's talk about last year first. So 2021 was not the best year for me. I had a lot of stuff going on. A lot of my plans fell through. Like every single thing I would plan, all of a sudden I couldn't do it anymore. So I had to scramble for something new to do. It happened with school, it happened with just social life, it happened with health, it happened with literally everything last year. So I was always scrambling and always finding new solutions so it wasn't the best year if you have been following me for a long time you have will know and notice that i've encountered a lot of injuries especially in the past year and that hasn't been the best but i'm doing a lot better now i took december off originally i always take december off just because it's like my time to recuperate to spend time with my family to like edit anything i want for the new year or like plan for the new year but this year i had to take december off because i got a head injury um i fell off a height from about like two feet up and landed right onto my noggin so that pretty much knocked me out literally for a while so i've been recovering from that and what is included in that recovery sort of is I can't really go on screens for that long. I have to rest a lot. I can't really do a lot of like stimulation really because I get headaches a lot. So if you know me personally, my personal life, you know that a head injury is not the greatest. I mean, it's not the greatest in general for anyone, but for me particularly, it is not good at all. So I've been taking all of December and a lot of January recovering and I'm feeling a lot better now. I still have a couple of symptoms, but I'm taking care of it. So uh, this year, 2022, I have a lot of fun things planned, but my main priority this year is to focus on my health because last year I kind of put my health to the side even when I really needed to take care of stuff because I wanted to create content, I wanted to stream, I wanted to do stuff. And I've realized, especially this past month, that I really need to take a break for myself. I really need to take care of myself and I realized I haven't really been setting the best example to my viewers because I'm always like, oh, I'm in pain, this hurts, this is what happened to me, but I'm still pushing through and like, I want to be a good example to people be like, take care of yourself. Like, I'm taking care of myself, you should take care of yourself. And I also, this year, I may have more health problems, I may have more things going on, but I'm going to keep that maybe away from my channel so it can be like a safe place for you guys to like not have to worry about me because that's something I'm a little bit self-conscious about just because of stuff I got bullied for a little bit over people are like, oh, you're faking or like, I can't take hearing about your stuff anymore. So like, I'm just going to keep it to my personal life, to my family, my friends. I'll still be like leaning on people for support, but like with you guys, I'll be more um just focusing on content and fun things with you guys instead of like help me i'm i'm sad i'm in pain so that's my goal for next for this year 2022 is to focus on my health make this a safe safe space for you guys so you don't have to worry about me even though if you're not worrying about me like i don't want you to be like oh my god she's not posting again because of this you know so that's kind of like my concern and my goal for next year. I wanted to start streaming already, but uh, unfortunately, my camera broke. <laughs> I'm, I'm recording this right now on my phone, like the OG days. My camera, um, it was a manufacturer error, so they need to replace one of my screens on it. And unfortunately, there's nowhere to do that anywhere I live. So I had to ship it all the way to Connecticut. <laughs> I shipped it at the end of December. They are just starting to fix it now, so I don't know when I'll get that back. Hopefully before the end of January so I can potentially stream again. I don't know if I can do that via my phone, but maybe I'll try. I have been playing Genshin Impact on my own just to like keep updated and to pull for the characters I want. Um, we have Albedo, we have Zhao, and we're saving up for Shenha. And um, 
I'll share more about my plans for the next banner soon, but we've got a lot of plans for Genshin Impact. I also have gotten some requests about um, reacting to the trailers for Genshin Impact, like the general trailers of what's coming up next, character trailers, and then um, some people sent me links for like character demos and character showcases, so I'll take a look at that as well. I'm pretty sure that'll be like the best plan of act plan of action for me for the first couple of weeks once I get back to streaming is just to like do reaction videos before I start doing gameplay or maybe just like gameplay where I'm pulling uh, for characters. I'm also gonna probably get back into Sims. I've gotten some new attention on my Sims video so I will provide for you guys. As far as like my other content goes, this past year 2021 I've kind of narrowed it down to like three focus areas, more like two focus areas, which is gaming and makeup. You can see I'm wearing some makeup now. Fancy, fancy. But so I'm gonna continue that line of focus. And for makeup, my next coming video is I'm gonna have a review on some Genshin Impact palettes by Bun Chewy. So I have that already and I'm just gonna record that coming up very very soon i got like three palettes and a blush so i'm really excited for that then i have some other makeup i can review and then just makeup looks from like my past genshin impact looks and stuff i come up with um as far as my other my third focus which is cooking i don't know how easy that will be i still have some difficulties but i'm i have some new equipment a stand mixer so maybe i'll be able to do something i still really miss doing like travel vlogs and stuff so maybe i could do something around the island uh, some people have really told me that they want me to do like testing food and restaurants and stuff but like i don't really eat in restaurants i'll do like takeout so i could do something like that if there's an interest for it but I don't know. Also, I'm kind of a picky eater, so I don't know if I would be showing the right food for people to try. <laughs> but that, there's a plane. But that is something that people have shown interest to me in like person, so I can take a look at that. Uh, another thing, my hair is growing out quite long. It's blue still. We're still in like the blue phase, but we're going purple soon. We're going into our purple phase. I don't know, like a lot of my stuff is blue and now it's gonna be purple. So yeah, so that is basically what is going to be happening. Updated you guys on 2021, told you guys what's coming up for 2022. Um, I will keep you guys posted on YouTube community. There's a mosquito on my open chest. I will keep you guys updated on Twitter and on Instagram stories. Um, if there's anything you want me to do in the new year, any new content you want me to try or anything you want me to react to, uh, please message me on Instagram DMs. If you're over 18, you can join my Discord, which will be, um, it's linked on YouTube community, but I'll put a link down below with an invite. So yeah, that is all I have for you guys today. My, I haven't introduced you guys to my cat, my feral cat. He's been hanging around now for about a year. So he's officially part of the family. I'm gonna see if I can get him to come over here just so I can introduce him to you guys. Cause you guys have met Mika, but you have not met Kit. Kit is actually short for Kitty because I've been calling him Kitty for the longest time. I just, back off. It was just recently that he's been like, you know, cuddly. He still won't let me pick him up cause you know, I don't think he's ever had a home before. Boo. But let's see if I can get him over here. Kit! Come here, Kit! Kit! But yeah, so that's all I have for you guys today. Make sure to like and subscribe. You can go over and follow me on Twitch. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, join my Discord. I'm really on any social media you can think of, either under Tybug or Ty Elato. So I will see you guys very, very soon. Thank you guys so much for your patience and still supporting me during this time. I really, really appreciate it. I've gotten so many kind messages and people supporting me and wishing me well on my recovery. And I gotta admit, I have been very emotional. I have cried very easily. And you know what? I'm not ashamed to admit that I'm an easy crier. If you have seen me on Twitch, you will know. I cry at the drop of a hat. 
So getting all these kind messages of people saying they miss me and they wish I feel better, oh, bawling my eyes out. So thank you guys so, so much. Yeah. Bye, love you.